Just last week, we shared video of a mail theft from a blue collection box using a so-called arrow key stolen from letter carriers. It's a crime trend exploding in Milwaukee. Most of the time I try and go inside, but uh, I only will stop here because I know that they, they, they usually get the mail out at a certain time, so that's why I stopped today. But any other, the, the blue boxes, uh, I don't feel safe with them. Now we're learning police and federal agents are striking back. In the midst of at least five armed robberies of letter carriers to obtain those master arrow keys, we've learned police in January raided a house near Buffum and Wright where they believe a postal crime ring targeting the carriers and stealing mail was based. According to the criminal complaints, police and agents seized six guns, a bag of opened mail, and two arrow keys, and also found the target of the thefts. More than 900 personal checks made out to hundreds of different people and chemicals to, quote, soak checks in that will cause the ink to be removed, turning it into a blank check. According to the criminal complaint, even after that raid, some of the ring kept going with at least two more armed robberies of postal carriers and the theft of mail from this mailbox here on Teutonia just a few days ago that led to two more arrests. 22-year-old Darian Allison and 21-year-old Haria Abu were in court Friday, charged with the armed robberies of letter carriers. Involving robbing um, mailmen at gunpoint, stealing their arrow keys, stealing mail, and then washing checks. Three of the eight suspects are facing federal charges with possible life sentences if convicted. One of them, 22-year-old Hussein Haji, told investigators he knew of at least, quote, 40 instances in which he and others used the arrow key to remove mail from the mailboxes. Nick, police tell you the investigation is ongoing. Could there still be other people charged? We think so. There's at least one other suspect who is named in these complaints who has not been charged yet. And we're also aware of other robberies and mail thefts that are not detailed in these complaints either. All right, Nick Gore reporting live in Milwaukee. Nick, thank you.